I do a little bit of wine. I make wine. And so I thought, oh, I need to have something to go with that, so I might as well do the cheese, and we've got the milk. What started as a little bit of cheese for themselves and a few samples for the neighbors is churning into a business opportunity. You can see the different textures. Bessie's Best is now making cheese. It's extra work, but it's, um, I don't mind it. It's because I enjoy doing it. I enjoy making it. You can choose from original or pepper cheese curds. Get says they are processing 240 cheese curd containers each week. I was thinking a few gallons. Blaine was thinking a few more gallons. <laughs> it's always like that. <laughs> she says in a few weeks they will also be selling cheese wheels. They don't blow all of Bessie's production on cheese and milk. Bessie saved a few gallons to add a vanilla and a strawberry yogurt to the product lineup. Get says just like the milk and the cheese, they're keeping it natural. We keep it very simple. It's just your culture, and then we do add some sugar and vanilla to it, and then we'll be, you know, and then strawberry will be the same thing, except we'll have strawberries in it. This is going to be a different kind of yogurt. It comes in a quart container, and Get says it's probably going to be something that you might pour rather than use a spoonful. All, pretty much all natural. There's no gelatins or thickeners in there. This is this is the way it is. Uh, it. I, I think, it, it, you know, a guy could pour it into your cup or whatever. Get says live cultures do all the thickening in this yogurt. He says they're looking at possibly creating a berry berry flavor in the future. In Sterling for KX News, I'm Sarah Gustin.